nothing but uh, okay this project is nothing but uh, what we can say this agotar je je project jhali hote tasa ek uh, output hota human geno project okay so starting from a prokaryotic organism like as bacteria and all so it is going in uh, so the knowledge of uh, dna sequencing has evolved much more okay so after the uh, methods and sequencing techniques has simplified the scientists has developed uh, approach towards the sequencing of human genome okay so basically uh, it is aim to determine the complete sequence of nucleotide base pair that make up human dna and all the genes it contains okay so that's why in terms of uh, genomics this project is very much important okay so it generally started in the year 1990s okay so the idea was uh, picked up in, by the gov us government in the year 1984 but the actually work was uh, and the project was launched in the year 1990 okay so it still remains the world's largest collaborative biological project okay so many country have collaboratively work under this project and they have just uh, uh, submitted their own uh, their own share of sequencing okay so that's why it remains the one of the most largest collaborative biological project okay so anyone can tell me the how uh, how much or what are the quantities of chromosome that are present chromosome numbers that are present in the human cell Sorry, human body. Okay, you can tell haploid or diploid chromosome number. Human mother chromosome number kiti asta. आवाज येतोय का सर ट्वेंटी थ्री पेर ओके सो दॅट्स वाय इट इज व्हेरी इम्पॉर्टंट टू स्टडी द्युमन जिनम प्रोजेक्ट टू it takes near about uh, 13 years okay by the government to take uh, to complete this project okay in the year of 2003 the report was launched okay so this uh, human genome project is originally aimed to map the nucleotide contained in a human haploid reference genome okay so it is generally started to uh, obtain the sequence of nucleotide in the human haploid reference genome okay? so started uh, with the human haploid reference genome only okay so what the term genome means that you all know that it's a complete sequence of uh, dna okay? inside the uh, individual cell okay? so it generally you know uh, sequencing and assembling this uh, sequence together okay so what they have done in the in, in this genome project the firstly uh, isolated the dna from uh, every individual okay it is not from particular individual they have sa taken sample from of dna is nothing it is not taken from individual from so this kala kala human genome project me study so barasha individual the sample mudun getla gela okay the sample je hote the sample size near about 10000 ch aspas hote so sample collect kele and was to extract karna jala the dna extraction nantar is a cloning karun सिक्वेन्सिंग करून असेंबल तो सिक्वेन्स करण्यात आला ओके 
त्यावेळी लक्षात ठेवा की तो जो सिक्वेन्स घेणारा होता तो कोणत्याही एका इंडिव्हिज्युअलचा नव्हता एवढे इंडिव्हिज्युअलचा होता ओके गोल काय होते त्याच्यावाले मेनली टू आयडेंटीफाय अँड मॅप ऑल द ट्वेंटी थाउजंड टू ट्वेंटी फायव्ह थाउजंड जीन्स ह्युमन डी फ्रॉम फिजिकल अँड फंक्शनल स्टँडपॉइंट ऑफ थ्री बिलियन केमिकल बेस्टवेअर मेकअप द ह्युमन डी ओके टू स्टोअर दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन इन डाटा बेस टू डिस्कवर मोर एफिशियंट टेक्नॉलॉजी फॉर डाटा अनालिसिस ऑल ओव्हर द प्रायव्हेट सेक्टर ॲक्सेस access to this information and technologies that arises from this project also to sequence the genome of other organism that important in medical research to address the ethical legal and social issue okay these are all the uh, goals of human genome project at that time okay so they have uh, changes from time to time but at, at the starting point they are generally to sequence the dna and generally uh, to store this database in the wild in the in a bioinformatics field okay or in a biological database form so these are the main or you can say objective of human genome project okay so they are starting this human genome project uh, a few years or after so many years some private people also enter into this field okay into the field of genomics some private so ata yacha madhe kai private company pan participate kele the project madhe ani maya mate private company tyacha peksha kami time span madhe to project cover kela hota for a participating countries and funding agencies so i think what the point the point ahe ki कोणी स्टार्टिंग होतं त्यानंतर दुसरे कोण कोणते होते एजन्सी त्यामध्ये फंडिंग एजन्सी इन्वॉल्व होते सो इन नाईन्टीन नाईन्टी द टू मेजर फंडिंग एजन्सी सो आज आय सेल्ड अर्लियर मेन ओरिजिन ऑफ दिस इन द यू एस स्टेट सो यू एस डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ एनर्जी अँड नॅशनल इन्स्टिट्यूट ऑफ हेल्थ दे बोथ बोथ हॅज पार्टिसिपेट currently they have developed an mu in order to coordinate plans and set plan for the initiation of the project okay so the main is the us that is department of energy and national of health okay nih so they uh, collaboratively so you mo you tayar kela and then the project was done the most of the government the sequencing was properly continuous at the center in the the country that is us uk japan france germany canada and china so these all countries has uh, participation okay, through the sequencing of so on short sequences okay and the sequence the segment of dna is very key uh, work okay it requires some skills and so many uh, laboratory machines and all okay so that's why uh, only developed countries that were evolved in this into this projects so parallel projects was conducted outside the government sponsorship by the operation or the cellular okay, which was formally launched in the year 1990 okay i said earlier that some private players also uh, were, okay. so they started in the year 1998 and they also completed uh, in less time span okay uh, so now three billion project it was in the year 1990 okay that they have objective to determine the dna sequence of entire eukaryotic diplomatic human genome within 15 years some uh so look pilots of 
ধনঞ্জয় প্রজেক্টিস রবার্ট সিং সিজমের প্রোটাইড অফ টু সিং অফ ইউ নো ইন দ্য ইয়ার 1985 দিস আর সাম অফ দ্য সাইন্টিস্ট হুইচ ওয়ার পাইনিয়ার অফ দিস প্রজেক্ট so it was uh, the project act was passed in the us congress and the president reagan in the year 1988 okay then after uh, jim watson and francis collins were evolved or hated this project so uh, francis collins was the director of the uh, national institute of health at that time and they later become uh, the National Human Genome Research Institute, okay. Then after it has splitted in 2003 and they have uh, the charge of director of that uh, project up till now. Okay? So for the assembly purpose, so Jim Kent, the PhD scholar who has developed a software that called as a GIG assembler. Okay. So these are these allow to assemble the sequence of DNA, okay, and to publish the human genome sequence. Okay, now you here you can see the timeline that's starting from Frederick Sanger's uh, techniques. Of DNA sequencing to the Robert Singer, the proposed idea to the US De uh, Department of Energy and AI to launch the, uh, the come forward for the project and then after actual starting of this project. Okay. Then after uh, NIH becomes NG, NHGRI, that is the uh, research project institute. Then after E. coli. Big genome sequence in the year 1997 in the year 1998 the pilot plan for human genome project was published so earlier uh, the completion of the human genome project uh, some of the uh, prokaryotic or uh, prokaryotic bacteria was sequenced earlier, okay, in the year 1997 and 1998, okay, and in the year 2002, the Arab process also sequenced. Okay. So, in the year of 2001, the working draft of human genome sequence was published in the Nature and the Science Research. Also, okay. Here, 2003, the final version of human genome sequence was completed and it was published. Okay. So, uh, we will now study the technical aspect of the human genome project. So the process of determining the human genome first involves the genome mapping and or characterization the characterizing the chromosome. This is called a genetic map. The next step is DNA sequencing and determining the order of DNA bases on a chromosome. These are the physical map. Okay. Using restriction enzymes, okay. Okay, uh, genetic map purpose they are using some of the genetic markers, okay. So these are very valuable for, uh, for valuable for mapping strategies, okay. So, uh we also studied earlier in chapter of genome mapping, the genetic map is showing relative location of this specific markers, okay? 
तो आता जेनेटिक मैप मध्य रिटिव लोकेशन अपन चेक करते तो स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम जेनेटिक मैप अपन तिथे मार्कर च यूज कर लोकेशन तिथे पहले मेजर करते ओके रिटिव मार्कर अकॉर्डिंगली टाइम मेनली जे मार्कर यूज कर आर एफ एल पी ओके सो दिस आर एफ एल पी मार्कर आर मेनली बेस्ट ऑन द रेस्ट ओके so that's how uh, rflp reflect the sequence difference in the dna site which are cleaved by the restriction enzyme okay. so sequencing strategy madhe ata yacha madhe tumhala third point kala hai ki genetic je apan te tayar kele hote okay and apan se karto okay The sequencing mode, sequencing strategies mode. So firstly, uh, the, the strategies or technique mode, two main techniques are. You go the shotgun technique, and the second one is Sanger sequencing method. Okay. So sequencing method is similar to the shotgun sequencing mode. You have to apply the clone to prepare the soil. Apply the sequencing method. Okay. ओके आता हे मेथड मध्ये तुम्हाला दिसेल शॉटगन म्हणजे काय ओके एक्चुअली शॉटगन म्हणजे त्या जेनेटिक डीएनए चे सॉल फ्रॅगमेंट आपण तयार करतो ओके ओके स्मॉल फ्रैगमेंट आपस
हेलो फ्रॉम विच पॉइंट आई हैव नॉट टेकन सिंगल सीक्वेंस ओके देन ओके okay the sign of sequencing is also depend on the chain termination this method is mainly used in the sequencing of human genome the outcome is mainly it comprises uh, near about 22300 protein coding genes in the human being at the same time it contains near about uh, the Ellingus, that is nematode, which contains the same number of genes, but as compared uh, to the So compared to the same number of gene, uh, so due to the uh, coding region mainly code for the more than one protein. That's why compared to other organism, the human proteome that is the total number of proteins that are high in numbers. Okay, compared to other organism, human with the the coding region is so more than two protein la code ko toh jaan wo sath protein sa to number hai so just just okay. But compared to other organism, gene those protein coding gene gene is the same way. Those of like your mouse model. Okay. So that's why human has a large number of proteins. Then gene density he uh, chromosome number nineteen or just that that is twenty three genes per million base pair. Okay. आने जीन डेंसिटी लो आए और थर्टीन नंबर को मुझे उम्र डेट इस फाइव जीन्स पर मिलियन बेस पेर ओके दें आफ्टर ह्यूमन जीनों कंपराइजेस ऑफ टू परसेंट ऑफ एसोस डेट इस नियरली अबाउट टू परसेंट ऑफ कोडिंग रीजन एंड नाइनटी एट परसेंट ऑफ एंट्रोल डेट इस नॉट कोडिंग रीजन सो यू शुड नो दैट द it mainly comprises a uh, non coding region okay you might know mainly comprises of non coding regions then what are the objective of human genome project uh, so starting at the starting point it is mainly uh, aimed our objective is mainly to sequence the dna okay nucleotide sequence only firstly okay. Then after the uh, sequence of this DNA that is mainly used in the uh, discovery of this is causing genes, okay? And it is mainly to identify the mutation that is occur in uh, human genome. Okay? So these are the secondary application or what we can say the supplementary application of this human genome sequencing, okay? Then after this sequence was uh, studied and then this. Assembled sequence was stored inside the biological in the form of biological database. Okay. Okay. This chapter is completed now. One or two guy doubt aayega. ओके ऐसे मत तुम्हारे मेन जो कंट्रीब्यूशन आए साइंटिस्ट से जहाँ अंतर तो स्टार्ट कुछ ज़्यादा कोनी के ला देन अंतर जो स्ट्रेटजीज़ आए तो वहाँ तो चाहे
सिक्वेन्सिंग मेथड्स को आउटकम का होता ओके पॉइंट महत्व है 